was in California for BeautyCon. Yay! And I stayed at the lovely Ace Hotel in downtown LA, which is super artsy, by the way. And here's a little view of the basic room that I had. And I know you guys want to see my beauty products. So my current favorite body products for the shower are, of course, Shea Moisture. <laughs> And this stuff, man, this stuff smells like pure sexiness in a bottle. I've just been wearing this non-stop. And this here is my go-to deodorant. You guys are always asking me about my deodorant. And my skincare, I'll list that in the description box below. The next day, I got dressed and I was so ready for breakfast. I was so hungry. And I'm wearing this shirt that says be beautiful. This is a gift from my friend Jessica Lee422 here on YouTube. Thank you, Jess. And I went on a little breakfast date <laughs> with the beautiful Maya. You guys know her as Shameless Maya. I freaking love her. You guys know that by now. She always has a ride, so she picked me up and here we are filming each other. Look at pretty Maya. <laughs> that night I went to a little style hall mixer and I met so many new faces here it was a really nice gathering um, but I met so many new people I really didn't film that much sorry by the end of the night I have to FaceTime with my boo and what better way to get ready for bed than to watch the movie Tangled the next day was beauty con day so I gave myself a little mask on my face and I did a twist out to lengthen my hair I ate some breakfast this is my breakfast basically a bunch of fruit and a nut bar I took a shot of ACV and I drank some water this is the only bottled water I drink when I'm traveling of course because I don't have my filter here later that day as I just walked into BeautyCon first person I see Andrea's choice yep Andrea's choice how pretty she is. I saw so many familiar faces and so many YouTube friends that I haven't seen in so long. I love Abba. And if you didn't know that by now, you know. I love you, Abba. And now I'm doing a little photo shoot for BeautyCon. Everything's just happening so fast. As soon as you walked in, it's like so overwhelming. Anyway, photographer Jesse shooting me for BeautyCon. As you can see, I was not dealing with heels this year. Someone told me there were cement floors here and I was like, nope, no heels. And now it's time for my beauty con meet and greet with some of my favorite girls. Yay! <laughs> guys is such an amazing feeling I never ever get tired of this I can't wait to do it again and it's just so overwhelming and I still can't believe that you guys come out and meet me so it's just really amazing and thank you all from the bottom of my heart thank you all so 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 much for coming out to this meet and greet and seeing me thank you
watch her all the time. I watch you all the time. She's awesome. Where's your girl? She's at How are you feeling at BeautyCon right now? What? Are you having fun? Yes. So much fun. It's, it's overwhelming. I just got hurt, by the way. Tell her what, like, tell them what just happened over here. Everything there just was fell. a table right it's like there. Five girls. When the fifth girl went on it, collapsed. Yeah. I'll put a clip in right now. Right. All right. There you go. I was gonna. I was gonna. And I got, I'm gonna have a pose here, you'll see that later. Oh no! But I'm good. And she's gonna have a I'm crowd of people. Her. Yes. Are you her? Am I her? That's like beyond this world. Okay. <laughs> oh. I can't even think my thing hurts so bad. Oh. I got. See, Alba came smart. She came with flats, but also yeah. she's tall. Yeah. You know, short Asians like me, we can't do that. Okay? You're cute. You look cute short. <laughs> But seriously, I got a bruise. After beauty con is the after party. with some dinner and some friends. I'll list all of these people down below. Got back to my hotel with a pile of beauty products and so ready for bed, honestly. And the next day was the day I have to fly back, but before flying back to New York, I went over to this organic mini market, which I fell in love with because it has so many wonderful snacks, and I grabbed myself a little snack to munch on before I have to head back, sadly. I enjoyed my lunch at this beautiful park nearby, and then I headed over to a bookstore, the last bookstore to be exact. I fell in love with this place. I am so freaking fascinated with this place. I spent like three hours here all by myself because that's what I do. The books were so cheap and so wonderful. I got all the books that I wanted and they were so cheap but it, I still spent over like a hundred dollars because I got a little ahead of myself because they were so cheap and I bought like 15 books. This is literally like the most peaceful and best chill spot I've ever been to. Oh, and all the books on the second floor are one dollar. sell other things not just books and they also have an art gallery and some other store that has a bunch of old stuff and you guys have no idea how fascinated I am with anything that's old not from this time I am just so insanely fascinated with anything old school New York? Uh -huh. Let me take a